I'm gonna be taking a video of the HTC Evo 4G running the custom ROM finisher. Um, see if I can get it in some better light over here a little bit. The white light doesn't do it too much justice. There we go. Again, this is running the um the the uh, custom ROM finisher by Magnus um, Ragnarok. Um, it's still um, 2.1 Eclair. It's not Froyo, but it runs smooth and you know it has all the stuff that you would want besides having Froyo. Um, I'm basically debating on whether to switch to um, Cyanogen um, when he gets his final build done. But I like the sense, you know, that's one of the things I like about HTC phones is the sense. And, you know, the Cyanogen doesn't have sense. So, uh, I want you to look at this. Um, I have a, uh, I took out the stock HTC lock screen and I put a, um, Vanilla, a clear vanilla with no, has no writing or anything on it. We'll unlock that. Um, you can see everything's red. Um, the even the clock is tinted red. I got the uh, custom Nexus Droid um, live wallpaper in the background, and um, everything's done custom on this. You can see the Evo on the um, phone part. Um, we'll go here. The apps. Okay, is this everything the same? Go. The market is red. We'll push the market, and you'll even see that the market is red. You can see the market up in the top left corner is red, and then you're gonna see it's customly done red. Everything is red. Okay. The phone phone dialer, you'll see that is also red themed. Again, this is a Sprint Evo 4G. I you got your Twitter, all your page that you would have on anything else, you know. Um, wanted to see what else is. Basically, the boot screen you seen it was um, Transformers Decepticon, and then it had the um, Droid stuff going going down it. It's pretty smooth. There's I haven't found any bugs except for the camera. Um, sometimes doesn't want to work, and then sometimes it does. And as you can see, it's 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 working right now. But you know that it does have issues. Sometimes it doesn't work. So this. To get this ROM, you're gonna have to fully, you're gonna have to fully root your uh, Evo. Um, the best method to do that's um, simple root. And um, you know, then you can download pretty much in any ROM. So I had the Droid um, notification ringtone on there also. So if anybody wants to know how to get this or anything oh one more thing the uh, Facebook widget as you can see is it's pretty cool it's um it's black so you know it's kind of the opposite in the the Google search is also red tinted everything in this is themed pretty heavy um, you can't really see the font because my camera's crap but it's a uh, custom font also it's not the same font for the whole thing it's a custom font so um, like I said if you guys want to know how to get it or whatever let me know um, we can actually um, try a different wallpaper real quick and um, so you can just see the droid X um, wallpaper in the background that's pretty cool too you know just, you know, a little something different, you know. So, I probably will try the Cyanogen, you know, eventually. But, you know, so there you go with the Droid X um, theme. Again, um, you got your vanilla 
lock screen, you know. And then uh, up here in the notification bar, uh, I want to show you that too. It's clear at the bottom, you know, but it's clear red. It, you can't really tell in here, but it's got a red tint to it. Um, uh, that's it for me. Uh, like I said, email me or hit me up if you want to know how to how and where to get it, or uh, if you need help on rooting your phone. A simple root. Um, the the new OTA edition will root it. It'll unlock unlock your uh your root and your NAND. So, all right, I'm out.